Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. During the year 2020 when the border tensions between China and India was at its peak the Indian army felt the need of a light tank. The PLA army has fielded its lightweight Type 15 tanks at LSE and in response Indian army has fielded its heavyweight tanks T-90s and T-72s. While the Indian tanks have better protection, the Chinese Type 15 tanks had better maneuverability at mountainous terrain due to their lighter weight. The standard weight of Type 15 tanks is around 33 tons, while with added armor package, it weighs around 36 tons. The tank is powered by 1000 horsepower diesel engine operated by a crew of three, which is gunner, commander, and a driver. The tank features a 105 mm rifled gun with auto loader and 38 rounds. It is also integrated with remotely operated weapon station armed with coaxial 12.7 mm machine gun and automatic grenade launcher. Due to its lighter weight, the Type 15 tank can be more easily airlifted. For example, the Chinese Y-20 transport planes can carry up to two Type 15 tanks and achieve long-range deployment of nearly 7,800 kilometers. So in order to match the PLA Army's capability, the Indian Army also planned to induct the light tanks for deployment at high altitude regions. The process formally began in April 2021 the Army released an RFI for 354 light tank tracked. DRDO is the lead development agency for the light tank in partnership with LNT as development come production partner. The design and development of light tank is being pursued under Project Zorawar. In December 2022, the Ministry of Defense has further given its acceptance of necessity for seven light tank regiments, each equipped with 45 tanks. As per the AON, LNT will build one regiment of light tanks, while the other six regiments will be under make procedure open for other private players to participate. The prototype for the light tank being built by LNT and DRDO is nearly ready and will be ready to undergo series of trials in December 2023. Two to three prototypes of tanks is being built for the trial. The time taken by DRDO and LNT to come up with a light tank prototype is really remarkably very less. The new light tank will have an approximate combat weight of 25 ton and can be easily transported via air, rail or road. It will be manned by crew of three and will also have amphibious capability. The tank will offer modular protection with bolt-on retrofitable armor. The tank's frontal 60-degree arc will have protection of STNAG level 4 and STNAG level 2 elsewhere. The light tank will have a hull co-developed by DID and LNT. Initially, the tank was to be powered by an engine by German firm MTU, which is a subsidiary of Rolls-Royce. As per the Times Now report, there has been concerns related to the availability of German engines because of which the American Cummins engine has been selected as a replacement. The tank will feature a 105 mm high-pressure main gun and 7.62 mm coaxial machine gun. The 105 mm gun will be made by Belgium firm John Cockrell Defense SA, which can fire at 42 degree elevations suited for mountainous warfare. The 105 mm gun is expected to be manufactured in India once the tank enters into series production. The tank will feature many next generation and niche technologies which includes artificial intelligence, drone integration, active protection system and high degree of situational awareness. This was today's update. 
please let us know your views on this in comment section if you like the video do not forget to like share and subscribe with this i would like to say goodbye and jai hind we'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector